Our cold temperatures can also make it tougher on your car, which could lead to a serious emergency on the road. Mechanics say you're more likely to blow out one of your tires. New specialist Brian Carlson is live with why. Well, Danny, car experts say in the cold, a lot of things in your car work a little harder, like your battery, your windshield wipers, and your tires. And that cold puts your tires at greater risk to blow. You may not know you have a problem. When the ground and air get colder, experts say your tire pressure drops and ups your chances for a blowout. For every 10 degrees of temperature drop, your tire will lose one PSI. Your likeliness of a blowout is substantially higher if you're not checking your air. Yeah, this was just this morning. Les Schwab manager Keith Cannon says right now people are driving in with blowouts every day. I mean, with us here being next to the freeway, I mean, we it's a daily occurrence. He says the vast majority of blowouts come from underinflated tires, something these drivers noticed and came to get checked. Well, my tire light came on. I wanted to be sure my wife's safe when she goes out on the road. Well, we wouldn't want to blow out, otherwise we'd just be stuck on the road. To avoid it, experts say the solution is simple. Just keep an eye on your tire pressure. If your commuter car, you know, and you haven't had it checked in over a month, it's probably time to get it checked. Drivers we talked to today say it gives them better peace of mind. I think it's really important because I don't want to be like walking on the side of the road. No, you don't. Now, tire places like Les Schwab, they say they'll let you bring in your car, check your tire pressure, and fill it up for free. It definitely beats the alternative. Back to you. It does, and I took advantage of that service just this week myself. Brian, thank you. Mm -hmm. You can stay on top of the plunging temperatures by downloading the KSL Weather app. You can get it wherever you find your apps, or you can scan the QR code on your screen right now.